What's up everybody? Today we have an interesting RAM kit which kind of goes really high when we're talking about frequency but also interesting when we're talking about CL. Now today we're going to talk about Pro X Mem. These are the Spear RGB DDR5 on 6800 MHz CL34 and they look quite minimalistic in I would say in terms of the height because they aren't that thick even though they have a nice passive heatsink but they're also not that high so you won't have any issues when we're talking about high profile RAMs and clearance for your CPU tower cooler or for the radiator or something similar to that but in general they do look outstanding. Now the inspiration is coming from Bident which was a weapon uh, from Hades also called as Pluto so this is something that some manufacturers uh, take into consideration when they're designing their products which is quite okay because sometimes you guys like mythology and you will find something interesting in this and basically that's it when we're talking about inspiration and how they designed their memory kit now in this box you get 2x16 6800 MHz CL34 which is quite normal for DDR5 right uh, it's XMP 3.0 ready we have RGB lights which can be controlled with uh, Asus Aura Sync MSI Mystic Lights ASRock Polychrome Sync and I think it's Gigabyte RGB Fusion as well so basically what we can say is it has support for Ondai ECC built-in power management IC SPD type is SPD5118 and the stepping is 1.5 the manufacturer of SD RAM is SK Hynix and the SPD manufacturer is Montage Technology Group something similar what we did with the past ones but I have to mention that so PMIC0 manufacturer is Richtek Power the device type is PMIC5100 and the stepping is 1.1 basically what we got here is a quite interesting RAM that can really perform and at 6800 MHz I'm expecting some speeds to go above 100,000 megabytes per second so as I usually do and I'm going to compare it to all the RAMs that I have uh, currently tested so we're going to go with AIDA 64 Extreme Edition uh, cache and memory benchmarks and uh, going to check out the read write copy latency and of course well the CL you already know since it's 34 but for this review I had to go to my friends and uh, test it out with 3900k since the current platforms that I am running are on AM5 which support maximum up to 6600 MHz so that kind of does give me a bit of a headache but I'm still waiting for the BIOS updates hopefully they will roll out something to basically use uh, higher frequencies on the memories without going into manual OC and doing everything like that so we have quite interesting stuff and I also did Cinebench R23 times Pi and Firestrike so let's start with the AIDA 64 Extreme Edition and read speeds go up to 105 1429 megabytes per second write speeds go up to 92134 megabytes per second copy goes up to 95428 megabytes per second which is really impressive i do have to say and the latency is 63.5 now 3900k with these rams in cinebench r23 got 37751 which is totally outstanding then with the same system of course time spy got score 23812 and the fire strike got 51354 now outstanding results with these rams and first of all they do look quite nice i mean what kind of inspiration i get from these kind of rams and this kind of designs is that they could be used in some modding adventure let's put it that way but for the performance i can't deny that they really do perform outstanding and comparing them to other rams in all the other spreadsheets that you saw while i was mentioning all the speeds you can see that they clearly do perform outstanding and uh, this is really good 
this is really good i have to say now i know you haven't heard about pro x mem but what i can say is they are placing inside even though i couldn't pick up from with my software all the necessary information about the memory modules and everything else memory chips yeah memory chips but uh as you can see from all the specifications, they are quite similar to the Asgard Bragi DDR5. So they kind of resemble with the specifications, the manufacturers and everything else. And that's quite important because as we all know in the past of my videos, Asgard Memories really did perform outstanding and they are equipped with quite nice hardware. So you can't go wrong with these without a doubt. And I can't say anything against the design is something that you will either love or you won't it's all up to you so there's that you've seen the tests you've seen the design you've seen the rgb lights and everything else is up to you so i'll place the links below for the pro x mem spear ddr5 rgb 2 times 1660 800 megahertz cl34 so you can eventually check out the price and the availability and all the other details if i might have skipped something and they added in the meantime you know how it goes guys thanks for watching this video don't forget to subscribe hit the like button and hit the notification bell well so you don't miss any future content thanks for watching see you very soon bye bye